Well, good morning. Welcome back to GP Outdoors. I've got a very unique product I wanted to share with you good folks today. It's not a spaceship. It's a chainsaw scabbard with wings. I got a call from a gentleman named Michael Hassler from down in Illinois in the USA. He gave me a shout a few weeks ago and said he's created this product manufactured in the USA by his family, which is a veteran owned family business. And he calls it the no roll saw saver. The scabbard is designed to make sure that your saw sits upright when you're transporting it. That's why there's wings on it. He said he got the idea because every time he transports his saws in the back of his pickup, he finds them bouncing around in the bed of the truck on top of the power heads because they never stay vertical. So he's designed this new scabbard with wings to keep your saw vertical when you're transporting it. The scabbard is made of a hard plastic and the wings are part of the mold. They're not screwed on or attached afterwards. It's riveted both sides and I believe it'll hold up to about a 24 inch bar it says. And I imagine you're probably thinking the same thing I am. Does it work? Well, let's find out. Driving down the road isn't much of a test. Let's take her 1.3 kilometers through the forest down to the cabin. You folks in the States, it's just under a mile. I'll be pretty surprised if this thing is still standing vertical by the time we get to the cabin. Still there. Nice. Last test. Big tool rack, back of the tractor, trails in the forest. Let's go.
finding it fits fine on my 18 inch bar on the 261 and it will also take my 20 inch 3 8 pitch bar for my 462 but I've observed that it will not take the 25 inch bar on my 462. The bar is too big to fit in here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, she stayed upright. Before I left Guy's shop this morning, we made a bet. It appears I lost. Well, Michael, I think you might be onto something. I'm pretty pleasantly surprised. You know, I gotta be honest, I figured maybe the pickup, probably the ATV, because it's kinda caged in on the back rack, but I thought for sure there was no chance it was gonna make it on the back of the tractor. <laughs> That's incredible. Thanks so much for sending it to me. I really appreciate it. It was great to be able to try it out and I'm actually gonna use it too. And some happy news, Michael didn't just send me one saw saver, he sent me two which means if you're interested in winning one, just leave a comment below this video. Somewhere in your comment, write no roll saw saver, like you see on the screen here. In about 48 hours, I'll pick the winner and I will reply to your winning comment asking you to email me at this email address below. Only this one. No WhatsApp, no text, no phone numbers, just this email. If you folks are interested in checking out the saw saver, I'll leave Michael's URL or his website address down below on the screen as well as in the description. And I believe if you are interested in buying one, you may find a GP discount code captured in the description of this video. Thanks again. I hope you folks have a wonderful week with your families. Please be kind and I'll see you again on the next one. I'm Gord Potter and you've been watching GP Outdoors. Cheers. <laughs>